Hello, I'm Crystal and it's 11.33 a.m. on the 15th of June 2018 and I've just got back from the library. Um, <laughs> what can I say? What awaited me when I came back and this was on the floor. Page you go from three, here's the trio sim you ordered. Well, I did not order a trio sim. Now you can all laugh and think this is funny, but a few years back it was quite serious and it was reported to the police. And so I also told my doctor that it was stressing me out and making me feel ill. So they have a record of this type of thing coming to my address. Now this sounds funny, okay, and okay, it is funny, but this person gets jealous serious and nasty and this gets offensive. It sounds like an immature person who's at home all day doing nothing who keeps harassing and stalking me and it's addressed to Crystal Farting F-A-R-T-I-N-G dash Hoffer because it's got the word ho in it which is H-O-F-F-E-R Crystal Farting Hoffer Six Lansdowne Court, Old Road, Chatham, ME4, 6pm. This I am not opening because this is going to be kept as evidence to give to the police at a later date. Because this is starting again and I don't want it. It's abuse. And it sounds funny, but why can't... That is actually fraud, using my name for something I haven't ordered. I have just been to Primark. Um, basically, because I live by myself, I'm an adult. A woman wearing a pair of shorts and a t-shirt is not a hoe. It's very hot weather out there. If I wore a coat and a pair of trousers, I would faint. I've got the menopause. I'm sweating like fuck, and I need some air. <coughs> In Primark, I got this Batman towel. Um, nice clean towel. Smells lovely. I also got this swimming costume, and the date on it is 1993. That is the day, my the year, my mother was incarcerated in a mental health hospital and was frightened to death and mistreated. The year 1993 for me, 68, 69, 70, 80, 93, I was 25 and I was living up in Gloucestershire and I hadn't even given birth to my three children then. So... Why someone actually chose 1993, well, let's, let's flaunt it. Let's flaunt their abuse. Let's show everybody what nasty people everybody is. But it doesn't affect me. That's more likely to affect my mum, because in 1993, she was put into a mental health hospital. And I was up in Gloucestershire. I wasn't down here in Chatham yet. I also went into Sainsbury's and I stood at the checkout right in front of the security guard. I've got my receipt in the bag. They were talking about someone stealing a bag full of stuff. And I got the Sun newspaper which has got Lord Leg over. Fling with Olympia and revealed after she is nicked. A former show jumpers affair with a married lord was exposed after she was arrested for allegedly daubing insults on the walls of his home in pig's blood. Um, we've got Robbie Williams sticking a finger up, his middle finger. Um, we've got Cristiano Ronaldo's girlfriend looks ready for football's biggest knees up. I bet she is. She hasn't got to worry about money, has she? One makes me laugh. Lewis Royal gives Queen giggles. Oh, I'm glad the Queen's happy in green. The 
queen that couldn't put the flag up for Diana until the public uh, made her put the flag up when Diana was dead. She's having a good old laugh there with Megan. Yobby Williams, it says. Randy Lord's a real trotter. In one of the papers yesterday, they've got bears. I think it was the Daily Express. And on my Facebook page, I had a bear with its tongue sticking out. So they had a piece on, on grizzly bears in the newspaper yesterday. How sad to get reduced to that. Never mind. Small, my, small things to see small minds. I've got my lunch is a free range egg and cress sandwich and some fish snack pack sushi because I'm trying to lose weight and I'm trying to get healthy and make myself better if I can. And a 30p tin of custard. Really extortionate spending. But my cat likes to jump in the Primark bag, but I don't know why. She's just come out of a Primark bag. Um, as you can see, I'm back at Lansdowne Court by myself. And now I'm going to talk about a little bit what it was like in the library this morning. Uh, the Asian man was in there and he went because it got noisy. Um, a girl with a bun in her hair came in with a can of Coca-Cola. She sat next to an old man and the old man talked to her. Which is fair enough because I don't want old men talking to me, to be honest. So she came in with a purse and a Coca-Cola can, sat down next to this old man and they had a chat together. Then a big lady with black hair with a bun in her hair came in with her partner. They sat down. The lady with black hair had a good conversation with her and wished her a happy day. Um, first of all, the long-haired dark lady wasn't on duty. It was a nice one. And then the long-haired dark lady took over and that's when the trouble started. Yeah, all this herb business again. And actually, I looked online about aerosol cans, and they actually can cause people, air fresheners can cause people cancer. So anyone thinking what she did was funny, and then end up with cancer themselves if they're not careful. They are dangerous. Aerosols can kill people, they're highly toxic. So it's not funny at all. 